Today, we're going to check out the new episode of Skeleton Knight in Another World. Now, previously, we got introduced to, you know, our Skeleton Knight. We've seen him go on a couple of adventures. He's met his little fox. His fox is with him now. And we're going to see what else he gets up to. You know, he's really trying to stay out of the spotlight. But it's kind of hard when you're a giant knight that is... Well, he's OP. And there's actually a group out looking for him because they realized somebody did something that shouldn't be capable of being done. Somebody's like super strong. They don't know who it is, but it is, it just so happens to be our boy. So with that said, let's jump into it. Logo reveal. Though before we do, as it turns out, most of you are not actually subscribed to the channel. So if you enjoy the content that we make here, then like the video and consider subscribing because you can help us reach our goals by the end of the year with just one click. And if you want to see unedited versions of our seasonal anime reactions, plus even exclusives for Freshest patrons that won't be cut up for YouTube for quite a while, you can join our Patreon. Link in the description. Oh, it's the lady, the elf lady. Oh, wow. A little more than a farce at this point. Okay. She gonna run into our boy? Oh, she's the daughter of the leader. Oh, okay, okay. Hey, it's our boy. How you doing coming out of there? Yo, you about to get clapped. Don't do that. Uh, that's a bad move. I would not, I would not recommend at all. This almost feels like an AMV, you know? Am I the only one that thinks that? This OP, I don't know. It kind of gives me like AMV vibes. Oh, I'm wondering, did she go in after him? He ain't killing these guys, is he? He just beat him up, right? No shot this dude just killed him. Absolutely no shot that he just killed him. Uh-oh, puppies. Wait, well, no, no, that means the puppies are free. Oh, shit. Oh, this is the dude behind all this shit? Oh. Master Udalon? I wonder if we've met this person yet. Because you're up to some villainy, bro. There's always like good guys to stop villains. Hello. Pretty obvious, right? It's like, it's the elf girl. Hey, stop it now. I right, good guy. That's racist. That's racist. Oh my gosh. Yo, just punch her in the freaking face. A bento? <laughs> Can't be all bad now, huh? You're still abandoned, but you commune with. <laughs> oh, she's like, he's too adorable. I can't. You better. Oh, Jesus. You must have ate him. Oh, that's fucked up. Bro, this... But he's not a person! Wait, look! <laughs> I'm a skeleton! <laughs> <laughs> Dang, he wasn't playing when he said he got a feast. Sheesh, bro. I'm trying to, I'm trying to live that life right there. Aw, that's probably the first girl you ever spoke to. Nerd. I'm just kidding. <laughs> We're gonna find the elf lady. Yes, we know his moves. Okay. They're surrounding you. Looks like these bones have caught the dog. I like that. I, I like the little dog analogy. About to play fetch. This dude's gonna get sliced in half. 
She's about to lose her ponytail and he's about to lose his upper body. This guy looks like a dick. I bet Bull Cut is actually the one that's that's the son of the the one lord guy. He looks like he wants to be a bad guy. So, ah, hey, hey, don't stop, man. How's she gonna beg with a damn cloth in her mouth, stupid? Yo. I told you, Mr. Udalon. Fuck him up, man. What are you doing? Go out there. It's time to get involved. You must help little crying kids. I didn't even see no blood. What is this? Did she even kill him? What the hell just happened? She cut their soul? Bro, you're about to lose your arm right now, stupid. What are you doing? Why would you? Dude, she literally has a sword. Why would you just extend your arm like that? Are you dumb? I really don't know how she's killing these people without any blood. Hey, this is so whack, dude. Wow. They decided not to put any budget into the fucking action just now. That was weird. The man is literally, what do you mean? He's like kidnapping. Of course he would do some fucked up shit like this. Stupid? Oh my God, dude. Why anime gotta be like this though, man? Ew. Yes! Break his face, dude. <laughs> oh yeah, man. We like that. That's good. Let's go. It's our boy. Armored Lariat. I <laughs> love it. Hit him with the clothesline. That armored clothesline. Ouch. Yay. We don't worry about keys here. I got the keys. The man just. Yep. Yank. Yep. I knew it. I knew it. Man, dude, this man's a knight, man. He's kind of big, though. Like, he is kind of scary. He's, he's a daunting, you know, like, he's kind of just towers over you. I don't blame them for being scared. Our boy's got a fix for this. He's just gonna zap it or something. <laughs> we love it. I love overpowered protagonists. It's cute. It's adorable. We like it. Yeah, this is our bony boy. <laughs> he turned into a jungle, a jungle gym. He uses transformation magic. <laughs> it's a bird. <laughs> oh. Oh. It is pretty cool. <laughs> I love it, dude. Mr. Armor. Bye bye. Great kids. Join the party. Join the party. Yeah. <laughs> I imagine that would be kind of weird, actually. I, I didn't get shocked by it, but seeing him shocked, kind of just like, oh, yeah, that is kind of weird. This bird just talked. I mean, I watch anime, you know, so like I see a bunch of anime shit, but yeah, that would be kind of weird to see him in person. You got money? But you got money, though? But do you have money? You got money to pay for this or no? Oh, we're going to fade. We're going to fade. All right. That's the end of the episode. It was fun. I enjoy this. I like this series. It's good. It, it's fun. It's it, it's cute. Okay. Yeah. So in this one, he runs into the elf girl that he met in, I think, episode one. And she has a mission. You know, she's trying to rescue some elf children. 
from bandits. These bandits are basically hired by this one guy who sucks. And it turns out that everything that our boy Ark has faced throughout these first two episodes and this episode are all the results of this one nobility, this one noble, right? So dealing with, with rescuing the, the, the one lady and the, from the carriage and stuff, killing those bandits and stuff. Boom, that was because of the noble guy. The noble guy hired those bandits. Slaying the big monsters that were like super hard to kill. Boom, that was the noble. He is the one that actually procured the monsters and set them loose in the area. And then this time, you know, it's the son of that noble, as well as some bandits, you know, trying to to gather some elves. Yeah, he helps out. First, he actually defeats like the first group of these bandits, slays them, steals their gold. Because I mean, that's stolen gold already. Like, who are you gonna return it to? So he steals that, goes off. He actually ends up fighting the, the elf lady. Elf lady realizes, oh wait, he's not a bad guy. And she goes off on her own. And then our boy has a mission to go and find her, help her. He does that when she is, you know, in a sticky situation where basically the bandits are using the elf girls as like hostages. These elf, these elf prisoners as hostages. And, you know, like she's in this situation where like, well, if I attack them, then these people I'm trying to rescue die. If I don't attack, then these bandits do bandit things to her. So, you know, but that's when our boy comes in, beats the shit out of the one guy who's like got the elves hostage. And then she goes on to slay every Everybody. The elf prisoners, they are initially scared of our boy, but it's hard to be scared of him after a while. You realize just how great he is. He shows off some of his magic stuff, which really intrigues the, the elf warrior because then she sees that he has some capabilities that, you know, are very unexpected. You know, you wouldn't see somebody with those abilities. Uh, they're not super common. So he's got to be something higher level, even though he's going about saying, oh, I'm a mercenary, whatever. She hires him on. We're going to see what happens in the next one. Are they going to be trying to free more elves? Are they going to take down more bandits? Are they going to actually get to the root of this and take down the noble? I don't know. I don't think they're going to go after the, no no the noble that fast, but who knows? Maybe in the following episode, they might. I'm just interested in seeing where this thing goes. I mean, we got to see this anime lady, this waifu here Ariane, i think her name was and you know waifu you know you know how waifus do so i think that a lot of people are gonna be you know maybe simping a little bit you know they'll be simping i don't doubt it uh based on her character design <laughs> and i'm interested in seeing after he helps her will she join him in his quest to like we haven't seen a main mission for him maybe the entire series is him helping her you know maybe it's not about her helping him i guess we'll just have to find out though i enjoyed it it was fun. Always love seeing our boy Ark do whatever, you know, and he's always feasting. He's always just enjoying himself. Doesn't want to get like too much spotlight. So he tries to stay under the radar, but he's always willing to help out a tig old bitty to anime girl. I don't know. It was, it was good. It was a good episode. Fun. I enjoyed it. So from here, I'd love to know what you all thought about this one down in the comments below. What are you thinking about this introduction of the Elf Warrior? And what are you thinking about the um, alliance that they're going to have? Ark and the Elf Warrior, Aisha. What was it? Alicia? Ariane, right? Aisha is the elf warrior lady in different anime, different anime. I think that I think that's her name in uh, Realist Hero. So that's my bad. Uh, you know, they kind of have like similar attire, really accentuates things. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you can leave a comment down below. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, then like the video and subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss another one if you're interested in anime themed content, since that's what we make on the channel. And until next time, make sure you all keep it fresh. Peace.